This presentation is about VirusTotal.com. Simply go to www.VirusTotal.com in your web browser and when the site has loaded you can upload a file to it and it will submit that file to be scanned by over 50 antivirus programs. So simply click on the Choose File button which is just here and then select what file you would like to scan. So I'm going to choose a Word document in this example and then when that name has appeared there you just click on the big Scan It button. That will now upload the file to the website and the website will then submit that file to the 50 something antivirus engines. So as we can see we're already getting some results back from some of the antivirus engines scanned by 17 of them now and no virus has been found. Now 26 47, so I'll just start to scroll down. It's still analysing the file. There's still a few more results to come through. Um, in a moment this blue bar will disappear as it gets the last result. Yeah, there we go. So now we can see the detection rate is 0 out of 53. So the all of the antivirus engines are basically saying that that file is clean and it's safe. Um, so that's great. Uh, now I'm going to run an, a second test and um, this time I'm going to choose a zip file called flux 30.zip, click on open, hit scan it and in this instance um, this file has already been submitted by someone else and it has already been analysed by VirusTotal. So here it's telling us that this file has already been seen and the detection ratio was zero, so it was clean. And it's saying you can take a look at the last analysis or analyse it again now. So I'm happy to just see what the results were. You might like to rescan it or you might um, be happy to see what it was as well and save yourself a bit of time. So it was scanned six days ago so it's quite recently and you can see here which antivirus program scanned it, what version of the um, antivirus signature files they were using and what the results were. So it's a useful site to know about um, just to give you more peace of mind when you go to install some, a program that you've downloaded from the internet. However, there is one caveat. Um, malware authors can also use this website to check their code and to ensure that their malware is undetectable by the antivirus software programs. So although I say it's worthwhile using, um, there is always the potential that something will actually slip through this and that you might scan a file and be told it's clean but in actuality there could be some malicious code in there that just none of the antivirus programs are picking up. Um, so just to be aware of that potential risk. Anyhow, it's a useful site to know about and uh, I hope you will use it.